if this is the first time you are watching my video visiting my channel kindly hit the subscribe button below and click the bell button to turn on the notification thank you Did a harvest, the first harvest last week. I'm hoping that next week at least we'll do another harvest. We did two buckets, so this time I'm targeting about a crate or two, at least above a, a big crate. you can see the whole of the farm this section everything is just tomatoes and tomato fruit in such a way that the first half let me say the first third at least we'll harvest two weeks start harvesting two weeks before but these ones because of the raid they've been pushed up and they are looking quite well this is the other side which had the capsicums as well and it looks like even though within the next two weeks they're already flowering within the month we'll start harvesting from here this is good this is good i can start anticipating to get three or four crates four to five crates a week at the rate at which this this is going God help me, but everything goes well. This is the main section of tomatoes that is producing currently. Then every look is just tomatoes, tomatoes, tomatoes. I'm a happy farmer. What I'm looking at is to see how to increase the size of these tomatoes.
find out how can I increase the size of tomatoes. For reason, I think these are cherry tomatoes that are producing here. There's another cherry tomato plant. I don't know how they got mixed up. the farm to do pixie oranges the pixies are doing quite well I can see their stem is quite firm the leaves are just growing and it continues to grow even though at a slower rate but when you look at the whole farm it looks like the tomatoes have taken over the pixies are there growing just like this one but next to it you can see the overgrown tomatoes Producing and producing and producing. It is our hope that the tomatoes will keep the farm running, take care of the farming costs, so that the pixie oranges at some point will start making their money marginal return. We've done the farming, the crop is coming up, it's fruiting, the fruits are going to be harvested, or the harvest already started. Now comes the part going to the market looking for buyers. It seems so far away. But right now we have to go and look for someone to come and pick all of these tomatoes. There are people who are coming to buy one offs. That is good, but we need a regular place to be able to take all of them in crates and boxes. So that is currently where we are. Where do we find the market for all this place? The further side of the farm. This one looks like it's choked. It's choked by weeds. the mulch mulch is helping it to retain water so as you can see these tomatoes 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 these are the tomatoes which I was anticipating in the next two weeks and they're already out thanks to the effect of the rain the stakes had already been put <laughs> They may not hold a lot. The good thing is like much has been put around each plant. So let's see. This was the last one to be planted. And so far, they're already up. This one is delayed. You can see they're already up and flowering. This is the session that I had been had. I was to give about three weeks for it to start fruiting. Well, the flowering, I've seen one or two fruits, like this one, way above their time. But this is good, let them continue producing. At one point, I wonder what's here. Yeah. This one looks like it's drying up. It was drying up, but pick up
all of this need mulch as of now at the rate at which we are going this fruit might start hanging down and insects will come in first so this is the work that will be done for next week mulch 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 on this side So far, that is what is happening in the farm.